course, in Kakamega, where NASA principals are also meeting. But first, we'll bring you up to date with Francis Atwoli. Francis Atwoli is meeting um, aviation workers right now as we speak to hear their issues on the aviation industry. We'll cross over right there right now to have a listen to what he say. Francis Atwoli of KOTU is speaking at the headquarters right now. Zakidini, whether you are a Muslim, you are a Christian, or a Kati. Kienda ulaya na onyeja wa zungu wa nashanga. Na ambia how our young women who graduated as engineers in the aviation industry maintain our national career. Need to be proud of them. Need to be proud of them. That is why, as I stand here, nataka kuona mukiwa kitu kimoja, tukiwa na union moja huko, and I'm appealing, I still want to appeal to his excellent the president. He should not get tired. I saw one of the people is proposing to appoint. I saw some of the people is proposing to appoint. In fact, we worked with him as our Labour Minister, John Munez. And one thing he inspired me with, he took time to learn. Akajifunza, akajua the international labour conventions, akajifunza, akajua our participation in the tripartism arrangement of the African Union, Labor, and Social Affairs. Akajifunza, <coughs> aka understand maneno ya International Labor Conference. Uko mpaka uonge kwa plenary na kwa kamiti ya serikali. Na ye akiwa na Mrs. Kitui who was PS, they did very well wakafanya Kenya government ikachaguliwa kwa ILO governing body. And all the time he was consulting employers, workers, and other government offices. So we need to have a minister of that type as a minister of labor. Kama president anaweza kutupati. I'm not campaigning for Munez. He can give, his, give us a name. Lakini with our ILE department, the East African uh, community, it will labor. Labor, labor is back in labor and social services. Labor is big. The Minister of Labor is a public relations ministry for Kenya, like the Minister of Foreign Affairs. It does not require fake ministers. It doesn't require fake ministers. Huh? That is why we have had numerous strikes. Because hata ile ilikuanga inaitwa consultative tripartite consultative council. Ilikufa. It requires somebody who can consult employers, who can consult investors to know what they want and what problems they are getting as far as employment is concerned. And then he consults Kotu. We give our views. And we assist that minister to run. Because here, we are more experienced, more than any minister that will be appointed in that area. We are the experts. And we are authority in employment matters. So, the president is moving in the right direction. On appointment of ministers. But he should finish quickly. To lock out lobbyists. <laughs> uh, because lobbyists, they, want the, they don't want work to be done. They want their agents for corruption in the cabinet. That's what they normally want. They are not bothered about service delivery. So the president should move fast and complete the cabinet. Two, I've been saying, and recently I wrote to him, I wrote to Raila. If Kenya is to move forward, because from August 
To date, we have lost more than 100,000 jobs. Here. The other report is going to come out at the end of this month. From our department, from our department of economic and research. We don't want to continue losing employment. We want to create more employment. And the creation of employment and political management are driven by sound economic performance. 